friends welcome to this session uh, semester 1 mathematics uh, basic mathematics uh, in this session uh, we are going to discuss the unit 1 which is uh, uh, titled as logarithm now logarithms and exponential functions are two cute functions of mathematics and uh, one must have very clear idea about the logarithm to understand logarithm uh, we will discuss first uh, certain rules of indices and then we will ultimately come to logarithm so friends let us begin with the rules of indices uh, let us say that uh, 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 this will be denoted as 3 to the power 4 this will be denoted as 3 to the power 4 similarly suppose i take any number a let me multiply a by itself up to say n times i am multiplying a by itself n times the notation for this is a to the power n jane apne gujarati ma m pan kahiye chhe ke a na ghat ma n etle atyare ghatank na thodak niyamo nu jhadpi revision kari liye indices kevama aave chhe ne jem ke pehlo niyam a to the power m multiplied by a to the power n this will be equal to a to the power m plus n you have studied all these rules just we are taking one overview of the same next let us say a to the power m to the power n a to the power m to the power n as we know this will be a to the power mn a to the power mn if you change the role of n and m the result remains shape like this ghatank na niyamo je school mathematics ma bhanya chho enu je ek jhadpi apde revision kari raya chhe agar jem ke a to the power minus n what do we mean this is nothing but 1 upon a to the power n 1 upon a to the power n further i have a non zero number a is not equal to 0 then a to the power 0 is always one as we all know so this is to begin with this is to begin with indices and now we ultimately come to the title of the topic logarithm 
before I give the precise definition before I give the precise definition let me begin with one question something interesting we are taking the axis x axis y axis origin fine let us take uh, one function say y is equal to 2 to the power x 2 to the power x what we are doing now we want to plot this function in other words we are going to draw the graph of this function so for that uh, we will be preparing the table dasma dhoran ma pan jare alekh na ullekh aave tyare x ni vivid kimmato apelu vidhe alag alag kimmato thi apde ene plot karavana che x ni kimmat udaharan tarike me lidhi 0 2 raised to 0 is 1 as you all know let me take x equal to 1 2 raised to 1 2 next value 2 it will give 4 and so on we will be able to have different sets different x and y and uh, let us draw the graph of this for example when x is 0 this y is 1 when x is 0 y is 1 the point will be somewhere over here when it is 1 y is 2 when x is 1 y is 2 so it will be possibly somewhere over here 2 it is 4 and so on suppose I would have taken minus 1 ok let us take it then 2 to the power minus 1 1 by 2 is nothing but 0.5 so when x is minus 1 y is 0.5 the point will be somewhere over here using the points let us draw a free sketch passing through it will look like uh, this one now now what we are doing quadrant number 1 2 3 and 4 pratham charan ane trija charan ne dubhakti bisect karti एक लाइन ड्रॉ करी। आई हैव ड्रॉन द लाइन। सपोज ऑन दैट लाइन, आई एम प्लेसिंग अ मिरर। अपने एक अरिसोम की है। अरिसोम की है, इतने आजे वक्र अपने ड्रॉ करे हो चहे। एनु मने मिरर इमेज मर से। एनु प्रतिबिंब मलवानु छे ये प्रतिबिंब के हुआ से तो ये प्रतिबिंब कहीं क लगभग आ प्रकार नो आपन ने मर से इतने थोड़ी इंटरेस्टिंग बातें थई कि घातांक की ये विधेय नो मिरर इमेज फर्स्ट और थर्ड क्वाड्रेंट में आ प्रकार नु मर्स है तो अन्याज जब तुमने जरा अनसार आप ही दो कि आज ही मैं आलेक ड्रॉ करे तो ए वाई इज इक्वल टू टू रेस्ट टू एक्स डेट वाज़ द ग्राफ 
for y is equal to 2 raised to x, the mirror image is logarithmic function. Ajay vakra apan ne dekha hai chhe, e chhe lagu guna ki avidai, kathang ki avidai ane lagu guna ki avidai. Havi, any saithantik vyakhya par aviye, के घातांक माथी लघु गुणक के भी रीते व्याख्यायित करो तो हवे आपने लकी रहा है चाहिए प्रिसाइज डेफिनेशन ऑफ लॉगरिदम ऑफ ए नंबर विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू सम बेस फाइन फॉर दैट लेट अस टेक अ नंबर ए which is not equal to 0, it is not equal to 1 <coughs> and is some real number, quick vastavik sankhya ke je sunya nathi, ek nathi. Ane, suppose, suppose, a to the power x, a to the power x is equal to n, some number. a to the power x is equal to n. Then, then the definition is that this power x, this power x is called is called the logarithm logarithm of this number of number n with respect to base, A is called base, this A, base A. So, this is the definition that power x is called the logarithm of the number n with respect to the base A. So, in mathematics, we have got uh, the symbolic notation for the same. In this case, this is denoted as, this is denoted as x is equal to, x is equal to logarithm of the number n with respect to the base A, with respect to the base A. So, now we are ready with the definition that anything A raised to x is an min or there is by implication, this implies that and vice versa, that x is nothing but logarithm of n with respect to the base A. So, as far as the logarithm is concerned, this will be treated as definition definition. So, considering that idea, earlier we have seen one function y is equal to 2 raised to x, this was the graph of the same. We took one mirror image, the mirror image of that graph was seen to be this one. 
this graph is for y is equal to log of x base 2 log of x base 2. So, exponential function and logarithmic functions are mirror image of each other. Ek bijana arishama pratibim che. To ane apne vyakhya tarike lai ne chal wo vad se. E na ghat ma x barabar n to ane toj x hitle log of n adhari vyakhya ek dam saral udha harano thi samajji apne janiye chhi ke bena ghat ma 4 2 to the power 4 the result is 16 2 to the power 4 is 16 compare the expression with this one my a 2 x 4 n 16 i am using the definition then x is equal to x is equal to logarithm of this number with respect to the base a 4 is equal to now we are using the definition 4 is nothing but log of 16 to the base 2 from, from where this came you are using definition fine let us find few more to get the concept cleared uh, let me say 10 to the power minus 3 indices 10 to the power minus 3 1 upon 10 raised to 3 the result is 1 upon 1000 that is 0 0.001 as we all know 10 raised to minus 3 is equal to that compare with the definition that is our a x is minus 3 n is 0.001 we are using the definition vyakhya no apne upyog kari raha chhi mate power minus 3 is equal to log of 0.001 point double zero one with respect to the base 10. So, this is the definition of logarithm as I said rules of indices what was a raised to 0 as we all know a raised to 0 is nothing but 1 fine let us apply our definition to this same expression that will be my x 0 a is the base n is equal to 1 use the definition vyakhyana upyog karta 0 is equal to 0 is equal to logarithm of 1 with respect to the base a. So, we are getting one very useful result. Ek upyogi parinam apan nahiya mali rahu che ke sankhya ek no lagu gunak koi pan sankhya adhar tarike hoi 
any kimmat thai zero log of 1 with respect to any base it is zero fine suppose i write a raise to 1 well a raise to 1 mean a ok let us again apply the definition what is your x 1 a is a n is a definition says that this power which is 1 is equal to log of a with respect to the base a one more very useful result when the value of logarithm is 1 when the number and the base equate sankhya ane adhar banne ni kimmat jo saman thai to lagu gunak ni kimmat thai ek okay something more suppose i write uh, y is equal to 10 to the power x 10 to the power x again we are using the definition 10 to the power x is equal to n then x is equal to that is x is equal to log of y base 10 in logarithm any log any log whose base is 10 is known as a common logarithm common logarithm Similarly, as we all know, there is one irrational number, ek asame sankhya che e, jeni lagubak kimmat, approximate value is 2.718. Suppose I say y is equal to e to the power x, e to the power x apply the definition that will give me x is equal to log of y with respect to the base e with respect to the base e any logarithm whose uh, base is uh, number e is termed as e logarithm ne natural logarithm kewa ma aave che ane calculator apade bada frequently use kariye che hu mathematics ma lakhu ke log x base e y is equal to calcima calculator ma e tame joi sakta aso ln x thi lakhai chhe logarithm natural base ln x so that is what uh, i call it uh, the definition let us have few more examples suppose we are asked a short question what is the value of x if the equation given to me 
is log of x base 32 is equal to 1 upon 5. Suppose we are asked uh, this question, what are those values of x which satisfy this equation? x ni evi kai kai kimmat ho chhe ke j a sami karan nu samadhan kare. To follows the solution, let us solve it. I am given that log of x base 32 is equal to 1 upon 5, fine. Let us recall our definition. Definition was when a raise to x is n, then and only then x is equal to log of n base a. I insist on the definition that uh, one must understand the concept from exponent how we come across this logarithm. Ghatang parthi lagu gunak par apde kai rite aviye The equation given to me is the part of this type x is equal to log n base a compare your x is a is 32 and that 1 upon 5 is this one use the definition this implies this so if i use the definition I find that x is equal to a to the power x 32 to the power 1 upon 5. Well, 32 is a multiple of 2, 2 to the 4, 8, 16, 32. 2 to the 4, 8, 16, 32. So, we know that 32 is nothing but 2 to the power 1 upon 5, fine. 2 to the power 1 upon 5. <coughs> Using the rules of indices, a to the power m to the power n says that you have to multiply these two numbers. Okay? So, 5 into 1 upon 5, 5, 5 cut and I find 2. So, I claim that this is the value of x by which the given equation will be satisfied. I mean the strong use of definition. Further, suppose we are asked to solve an equation. The equation is solve the following equation logarithm of logarithm log of x this base is 2 outer is 3 and the right hand side is 1. We are in search of uh, that value of x we are in search of that value of x which must uh, satisfy this equation. Apde x ni evi kimmat ni sodhma chi ke j a sami karan nu samadhan kare. 
for the sake of simplicity let me say this bracketed part I mean log of x base 2 for the sake of simplicity let me call it t t is equal to log of x base 2 so I am calling this part as t so my equation which is given to us is no more than log of t base 3 is equal to 1 log of t base 3 is 1 again use the definition log of t base 3 is 1 then n a x n is equal to a to the power x. So, this lead me to using the definition t is equal to 3 to the power 1 3 to the power 1 which is 3 from uh, where we have written this step again it is definition vyakhya vyakhya et leke apdi vyakhya okay t is equal to 3 but what is t log x base 2 so log of x base 2 is 3 log of x base 2 is 3 again the same situation pachi vyakhya no upyog log n base a x implies n is equal to a to the power x x is equal to yes x is equal to 2 to the power 3 that came from the definition that is this one ane apade kidhi che lagu gunak ni vyakhya ana par thi j mane a parinam male che arthat मने जे समीकरण आप पामावे तो एमा हूँ x बराबर आठ मुको इटले ते समीकरण नू समाधान थसे तो आ समीकरण मा एक लॉग बीजो लॉग हजी आगर वधी ने अने हजी पन एक त्रिजो लॉग आप डे आपी सकिए जे लॉग ऑफ लॉग ऑफ लॉग एंड दैट कैन बी solved in this fashion and then na log mate koi t sankhya dhari lo ek pachi ek step mukta jau and j sankhya ho tamhe j kramma dhari chhe ena thi ulta kramma parat mukso atle j jaruri chhe j mool sami karan atu e sami karan no uke la padne mali jas se to a vat thai लघु गुणक नी व्याख्या अने सरल उदाहरण अने थोड़ा घना उपयोगी परिणाम वात आगर बता रही है कि लघु गुणक ना नियमों सो व्हाट आर दी रूल्स ऑफ लॉगरिथम नियमों पहला नियम नहीं बात करिए नियम एम कैसे है लॉगरिदम ऑफ प्रोडक्ट ऑफ टू नंबर्स बे संख्या ना गुणाकार नो लघु गुणक 
आधार में कोई संख्या लख तो हम पी आधार ई छम आप समझ ले मतलब कि नेचरल लॉगरिधम की बात चाली रही है कोई स्पेसिफिक संख्या आधार में न आपी हो न आपी हो तो आप ई छम समझ ले कोई संख्या आपी है कि तो लॉग ऑफ ए बी इज इक्वल टू लॉग ऑफ ए आधार में जे संख्या आपी है तेज ए बेज के प्लस लॉग ऑफ बी बेज के जो आधार में कोई संख्या आपी हो तो ना आपी हो तो इज ध बेस कहीं ना आप तो आयम ने अपने आ रीते याद रखीशू संख्याओं गुणाकार नो लघु गुणक बराबर लघु गुणकों सरवाड़ो लॉगरिधम ऑफ दी प्रोडक्ट ऑफ दी नंबर्स इक्वल्स सम ऑफ दी लॉगरिधम्स ओके लेट अस प्रोसीड अहेड एंड कम टू वन मोर रोल लॉग ऑफ ए बाय बी ए अपॉन बी टू सम बेस से के This is equal to logarithm of a minus logarithm of b. Whatever the base is given to us, whatever the base is given to us, plus. when there is a division of numbers you find subtraction on the right hand side okay third important rule is it says what about log of a to the power b whatever the base is k it says the number which is in the power comes in the multiplication that is it is b times it is b times log of a it is b times log of a okay how the rules are applied i give you one very simple example suppose we are ask what about uh, log of 1000 base 10 what about log of 1000 base 10 let us proceed log of 1000 is nothing but 10 to the power 3 base is 10 okay the rule says the rule says whatever number is there in the power comes in the multiplication so this is equal to Three times log of ten base ten, and we have just seen few minutes back logarithm of any number with same base is one. So this is equal to three into one. Result is three. so that is the third rule fine 
for that suppose uh, we have log of a base b base b this rule says that i want to change the base which is b i want to change it says that the change can be taken as under numerator is log of a denominator log of b and these two logs are to any same number k so if you want to change the base of the logarithm this is the rule so let us say that this rule should be remembered as how to change the base change of base okay so to change the base uh, we may apply this rule one very important derivation is there from this rule it is as under on the right hand side in the expression on the right hand side i have got k well k can be any number it can be a it can be b as a case ek udaharan tarike apne em samjhi liye ke k is equal to a k is a then what will happen to the right hand side my right hand side in this case will be as under my right hand side is like this log of a b z log of b b z log of b base a as that value is 1 i find log of b base a so the derivation the conclusion found is logarithm of a with base b here you are taking logarithm of the number a with respect to the base b you want to interchange adal badal karva che sankhya ane aadhar to ye aa rite thai sake 1 upon log of b base a to ene pan ai kapda taran ma lai liye char niyamo ni vat thai ekad be vadhare parinam pan nodhi liye let us get back to the definition what was my definition my definition was a to the power x is equal to n implies x is equal to x is equal to log of n base a acha apni vyakhya e ane n ne achalank dhariye x koi chal sankhya hoy तो एम विचारी सक आ समीकरण न मैंने उकेल मेलो एक्स बराबर लॉग ऑफ एन बेज ए 
आप जाए कि समीकरण में मत उकेल अर्थात चलनी किमत ए समीकरण में परत मुक तो यू समाधान थव जो एट्ले मतलब ये थाय कि एक्स की आज मैंने किमत मी है ये आ समीकरण में परत कर दी ए टू दी पावर लॉग ऑफ एन बेजे दैट विल बी इक्वल टू एन वेल दैट केन ऑल्सो बी ट्रीएटेड एज यूजफुल रिजल्ट दैट केन ऑल्सो बी ट्रीएटेड एज यूजफुल रिजल्ट ओके सिक्स सपोज I have an equation of the type, say, log of x base z is equal to is equal to log of y base z. समीकरण छे नौ दुआ जी भी बाबत ये छे के log नो आधार सरखो छे. जो आधार सरखो हो तो आ समीकरण में आपने मे एक्स इज इक्वल टू वाय एक्स इज इक्वल टू वाय ये आपने आ समीकरण में किमत मड़ी सके तो आ थे निमो पहला अपने व्याख्या की बात करी निमों जो व्याख्या निमों उपयोग कर उदाहरण एक्जाम्पल्स के गणी शक एत करिए कि जेम के पहलूज उदाहरण एवं लीए साबित करो कि प्रवदाय Prove that log of x to the power a y to the power b divided by z to the power c w to the power d. log to any base prove that this is equal to a multiplied by log of x plus b multiplied by log of y minus C multiplied by log of z minus d log of w. I want to prove this result. We have got definition. we have got uh, the rules and let us see how one can apply all these rules to prove the required result in order to prove the result let us begin with the left hand side what is my left hand side logarithm x to the power a y raised to b z to the power etc that is x to the power a y to the power b z to the power c 
W to the power D. Okay. This is what we are given. Fine. Let us use the rules. Rules. Log A upon B. First of all, division. According to the rule, I find x raised to a, y raised to b minus log of z to the power c w to the power d. So, from where I got this result? Because log of log of a upon b is equal to log of a minus log of b. Concentrate on something alpha into beta. There, we will apply the rule of logarithm log alpha into beta. And according to the rule, this will be log of x to the power a plus log of y to the power b. As we are applying rule number 1, there is minus take care, same rule is applied. This is multiplication. Considering the minus sign, same rule will give us z to the power c minus minus log of w to the power d. Okay. There, which rule has been used? Friends, you must uh, take care of uh, the rule which you are using in each step. Like, here, I am using log a plus log b, right. Further, in our list, uh, the rule number 3 perhaps, log of x to the power a, it says that a comes in the multiplication and so on for remaining minus c log z minus d log of w. This example is uh, very helpful and interesting. In engineering applications, sometimes there are certain equations in which one required to take logarithm, simplify and get the result. There, powers, multiplication and division, all three rules are applied over here. So, in our example, we wanted to prove the following. I was asked to prove a log x b log y minus c log z d log w that we have proved. So, I claim that this is my right hand side. So, this is the way to prove using 
definition etc fine let us find one more application one more example it is something as under solve the equation samikarano ukel sodo the equation is log of x log of x divided by log of 4 fine that equals n a barabar log of 64 by log of 16. This is the equation given to us and we want to find the value of x which must uh, satisfy the equation. The expression given to me is something of the type a upon b is equal to c upon d. Let us solve this equation as under. Okay. Let us attempt using the rules only. Fine. So, follows the solution. I start with what we are given. What we are given? Log x upon log 4 is equal to log 64 upon log of 16. Fine. On cross multiplication, I find that log of x is equal to log 64 multiplied by log of 4 divided by log of 16. So, this is what uh, friends we are having fine. Let us proceed ahead that implies of therefore, log of x is equal to as we all know 64 64 when I multiply 2 by itself 6 times I will get 64. Let us count that 2 to the 4 8 16 32 and 64. So, I am quite sure 2 to the power 6 ok 4 2 square ok 16 2 raised to 4. Let us use the rules power comes in the multiplication. Let me write that step over here please. This is equal to 6 log of 2 ok. 2 log of 2. Four log of two, and now let us simplify. Log log cut two two za four two three za six. So the result which we found is as under it is 3 log 2 ok. Again the same rule of power 
3 into log 2 results 2 to the power 3 and 2 to the power 3 is so ultimately I got log x is equal to log of 8 and we have studied it uh, we have gone through the rules if uh, uh, let me recall that rule itself for you log x base a log y base a equality of log with same base gives the equality of the numbers. So, that give me x is equal to 8 and hence is the solution. So, that was uh, what uh, we have gone through. So, in today's session, in today's session, we have seen how what is the definition of logarithm, how to apply it to simple problems, what are the rules of logarithm, and uh, how to deal the solution of examples using all these rules. Friends, in next session, we will continue with this one in details. Thank you.